Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Jensine, aka Jungle Naps, and today we are going to be doing a mascara review. Now, I've never done a mascara review because honestly, I've never been a fan of my own lashes. They're itty bitty, and I'm like, what's the point? You know, maybe you guys can't even really see that. But a while ago, one of you guys asked me to review the L'Oreal Voluminous Lash. Paradise and I saw the comment and I was like okay and then I kind of forgot about it for a while and I was at uh, my local Target and I literally walked by the L'Oreal station and almost all of these were gone there was like three left and I was like for mascara like really so I was like okay well there's only three left I better try this out right now, um, a little bit about me and my lashes. Um, if you guys have been rocking with me for a while, you might have remembered when I had eyelash extensions. I loved them, they were so convenient, they were absolutely amazing. But I'm actually moving very soon, so I have to say goodbye to my lash tech. And ever since then, I've been struggling with my, my own lashes. <laughs> so um, I actually normally use the uh, L'Oreal Voluminous Base. And I apply that before any mascara. This is kind of like a lash primer, if you will. It kind of like curls your lashes a little bit. And I was thinking I would love to combine these together, but I feel like a lot of you guys are going to ask me, well, how does this look solo on its own? You know what I mean? So I'm not going to use this, although these both work beautifully together. I'm just going to apply the mascara so you guys can get a real sense of how this works. Let me go ahead scoot y'all in and then we can get started okay so the packaging here is super super cute I can't remember the price off the top of my head but I'll be sure to put it down here it is definitely affordable and when you unscrew it you can see it's got a really nice applicator here and let me go ahead and scoot a little bit closer and start applying it to my lashes so one thing that I love about this is it's really easy to apply you can see it curls your lashes and you guys like you can actually see my lashes my lashes are so itty bitty this alone is like amazing I find that with one coat it does separate it nicely but as you add multiple coats it does get a little bit chunky but um, I really do like how it looks So this is what it looks like with, you know, around one coat. I do like to go in and really like get in and apply it the second time because I want my lashes to look a little bit thick and like have that volume, you know what I mean? This is where you really, really work it in. So, okay. I don't know if you guys can tell a difference, but I really, really, really can tell a difference. Like for me, to achieve this kind of result without lash primer, without, you know, a whole lot of fuss <laughs> or feeling like I want to add falsies, you know, on top of that is a really big deal. Like they actually, like you can see them and they're curled upwards. My lashes stick super straight and they're very short. So for me, this is like, oh my God. <laughs> okay, so now that I'm finished with applying this little mascara, uh, lashes look gorgeous. I do want to check in with you guys in a little bit because sometimes, you know, when you're wearing a mascara throughout the day, it does tend to like bleed under the eyes. So I'm going to have to come back and then check in with you guys and report back. But so far, so good. I'm loving it. I think it, it's a really great mascara. The packaging is cute. But I won't give you my final verdict yet until we see what it looks like at the end of the day. Hey guys, so I wanted to check in. I've been wearing this mascara for about four hours. No creasing. I actually added some to my bottom lashes after I finished filming. But don't they look great? Like, you can actually see my lashes for the first time. Like, that's amazing. And like I told you guys, that never happens to me. So, um, really, really, really feeling this mascara. Yeah, so far I only have nothing but really good things to say about it. I think that's the mascara I'm going to stick to. Like, I'm a believer now. And I definitely suggest that you guys try it out if you're in the market for a good mascara that's going to really make your teeny tiny lashes pop. Um, yeah. 
so I hope you guys really enjoyed this video and go ahead and check out some of my other playlists if you haven't or some of my other videos and I love you guys and let me know if you want to see more reviews and what you want to see reviews on and I will see you in the next one bye